Day six. Day six already. I can't believe it. Well, this is what I'm making for breakfast this morning. Nice and simple. And you guessed it. You know what I'm doing with that. Mock bacon again. Scrambled eggs on an onion bun. And coffee. Nice and simple breakfast. Nice and easy. Nice and fast. On day six. If you haven't seen how I've done this breakfast before, please go to day one. I made this breakfast on day one, and I think on day three, if I'm correct. Mock bacon and scrambled eggs. But this time I'm doing it on raisin bun. A raisin bun. Sorry, not a raisin bun. Oh, that'd be funny. I'm doing it on an onion bun. Yeah, onion bun sandwich. My sexy breakfast, it's so nice and good. I even stirred my coffee like you really should. So I'm going to go sit outside now on day six and have my breakfast. Well, it's lunchtime. I'm going to make some of these falafels. Falafels. I've only tried it once. My friend gave me a few of them uh, quite a few months back. I've never actually made them, so this is my first time. So I'm just going to open this bag here. Like, I know people do this, you know, with the beans and everything else, the chickpeas, and I've seen the recipes online, but I've seen this for $1.99. I said, ah, I'll try it out, right? So add one three-quarter cup of water. So I got the water ready. I'm gonna pour that in there. And if I need more, it says I could add it. I'm gonna stir that. Now these are easy to make, that's for sure. Then you just make them into like little balls and I'll put them in the air fryer. It should work in the air fryer. I've never, like I said, I've never made this before. Uh, it tells you that you should fry it up in oil, but that doesn't agree with me. So this is what I'm doing. Look at that. That's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see it. But, uh, oh, I like the smell. Oh, yeah, it's got a nice, nice smell to it. So now I'm just going to put it in my air fryer. This is going to be a fast lunch. I don't mind that at all. Make a little bit of, I think I'll make them like a little patties. There we go. Now this is high in fiber, so if you're planning on going anywhere, make sure you're near a bathroom, because I'm sure you're going to, you know, be tooting and pooping in no time. Well, I got six ready to go. That's all that fits in my air fryer for now, so I'm just going to put a little bit of oil on it. And I'm going to put it in the air fryer at... 400. 400 for 10 minutes, and then we're going to flip them. So if these are good, I'm going to buy some more of these boxes, because if they're $1.99 a box, uh, these are perfect for a prepper pantry. And they're, you know, shelf-stable, which is good. You can make these at camp, which would be good, you know. You could bring it anywhere, actually. Just gonna need a little oil in the pan, or if you go in your air fryer, I'm sure that, I'm sure that you could bake these in the oven as well. Can't see why not. Might make them a little dry, I think, eh? So I have a to total of fourteen little falafels. Okay, so here's a question: What? How do you pronounce this? Falafel? 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 
falafel. I think it's falafel or falafel. Falafel. It's the falafel. Menage. Of, well, maybe it's because it's in the French side. No, it's falafel. Print mix preparation. Menage. Ah, oh, it's in français. That's why it's in French. La falafel. I'm sure it's falafel in English and falafel in French. But uh, yeah, it's uh, smelling pretty good. Kind of smells like stuffing. They roll pretty good. I can't wait to taste them. This first batch is coming out. And I'm going to flip them. Oh, shit. I guess I should have sprayed the bottom. Freak's sake, really? This is horse shit. Some of them stuck to the freaking bottom. Damn it. This makes me mad. This makes me super freaking mad. Back in the stupid machine. I'm gonna put it in five, five more minutes on the other side. Well, I'm going to try these falafels. A bit dry. It's got a crunchy taste to it. It's good, but dry. It needs a dip of some sort. I'm gonna go check what's in my fridge. I had a creamy, I had a creamy dip in my fridge that came from when I had pizza last time. So that's one of those free things, I guess. You know, like free ketchup packets. So I'm gonna try that. Much better. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. They're good. Not my favorite thing in the world, but when you're hungry, they're not bad. All right, Jay, you want to try one of these or what? Sure. It's a falafel. 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 Yeah, it's stuck to the freaking air fryer. Try it. Try it with the dip. The, uh, what do you call it? Oh. Aww. Oh. part? Try it. Today. Better with the dip. Yeah. Better with the dip? Yeah. Uh, should I buy some more of these or? For me, no. But if you want for yourself, go ahead. Good for the pa panic pantry, I guess, eh? Yeah. All right. So I added some cheesies as a side. This would be good with cream cheese. I'm not sure what you would use for this. Maybe salsa or whatever, but I think cream cheese would be good. Would be garlic. But this, uh, girl, this garlic uh, dipping sauce is pretty good, too. Well. It's edible, but it's not my favorite. 
Okay, so I got three eaten, and it's like, I don't think I'll buy it again. At first, it was like, oh, it's really good. The first one was like, okay, you know. And the second one was like, oh, yeah. And the third one was like, oh. And Jay was like, he couldn't even make it a second one. He just started gagging. He said there was a flavor in it, like a spice that he didn't like. So, I don't know. I don't plan on eating any more of these. Maybe I won't buy them for my uh, pantry. But I tried the falafels. Uh, on a scale of one to five, I give it a two. Yeah, I give it a two. And now for dinner. So for dinner, James is going to have uh, some of that leftover lasagna. And I'm going to finish off the rest that's the, that's there. So I'm going to put that in his lunch. This one's pale. Pull it back. That's pale. He's going to have a banana, an orange, and an O. Henry bar for snacks. That's going to be his dinner for day six. I'm going to have lasagna for supper. And I'm going to have the O. Henry bar for snack, along with an orange. I don't want a banana. Well, there's no bananas, but I don't mind not going. I don't mind going without a banana. So there we go. That's lunch for today. After today, the lasagna's all gone. That lasagna was so good. Two days in a row. Woohoo! Well, tomorrow's day seven, guys, the last day of this challenge, and I still have quite a bit of food, so come back tomorrow and I'll show you what I have and what I'll make for my final day on day seven. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and be sure to leave a comment below. Bye for now.